So back in my freshman year, me and now who is the co-founder of uh, Rubber Chicken Productions, we met at school actually. We sat next to each other during chemistry, I think it was, whatever the first year they teach you in science. It's whatever you have to use math for. I don't, <laughs> I don't remember. But we were sitting there, and we're, we're working out this math problem. Everybody around the class, we the class about 20, trying to figure out this math problem that he had put out on the board. And the kind of thing it was, it was one of those smart boards where you like click in your answer, and it could be like any number uh, you please. So we tried for about two minutes, and we're like, we can't figure this out. No go. It's a no go. So we decided, well, let's just guess a number. You and me, let's guess what number. So we picked 27. And we were right. We, we, we Everybody had guessed and we finally put it in the board and we'd gotten it right. We were the only two of three people who had gotten that correct. That's kind of how the number, the lucky number 27 was born. And then, kind of on and on, it, I've discovered that it's just become more and more lucky. And so I have designated that to be my lucky number. One month, last summer or two summers ago, I had lost my wallet. It was gone for like six months. Uh, it was, uh, But before that, I, I went to a little place called uh, Lambert's. I don't know if you know it. You, people throw, the, the waiters go around and throw rolls at you. And you're supposed to catch them and to eat them. Uh, it's really fun and really good. It's, it's a buffet kind of place. It's expensive, but they throw rolls at you. But we had been there six months before. Well, six months after, I get this call on the 27th. Um, I get this call from them saying, we have your wallet. Do you want it? Yes. So I went there. My credit card was still in there. Everything was still in there. I think this is, this is I think, back when I didn't really know much, but I, I think I'd left my social security number in there. I don't remember. I don't know if I did, because I, I did for a certain point. I just don't remember if I did it then. I, I don't anymore, but this is, because this was back, 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 back. You're not supposed to do that. And so I got my wallet back that day. Also found out that same day that some friends from Italy, this is when we were in America, so, so some friends from Italy had come and were going to see us for the first time in two or three years um, that we'd seen them. So it was a pretty, pretty uh, happy day. And then uh, I had started dating a girl on the 27th of a month. Um, so I, I, you know, I remember it for that. And uh, the friend I was just talking about who was with me in chemistry, his birthday's on the 27th of December, so, I mean, it, it, it keeps popping up, and then a couple of my friends, I said, since I think I mentioned it's September, I have a couple friends whose birthday's on the 27th of September, and they're pretty close to me, so far, anyway. 27's become a very significant number. I thought it would be a good kind of backstory to tell, and just kind of a fun little you know, the more you know kind of thing, a little trivia thing about me. Hope you enjoyed. There will be more stories in the future. Uh, I will keep in touch. Bye.